Tonight, a lawyer who met with Jeffrey Epstein days before his death says Epstein told him he'd never tried to kill himself three weeks before, despite jail reports saying he did. That lawyer is speaking exclusively with our investigative reporter, Terry Parker, revealing what Epstein said really happened and why he decided to stay quiet. You'll recall Jeffrey Epstein was found dead in his cell in 2019, supposedly from hanging himself with bed sheets. And this was just weeks after the DOJ said he'd already tried to kill himself once and had been on suicide watch. But Epstein told a lawyer that's not what happened at all. Days before Jeffrey Epstein was found dead in his Manhattan jail cell, attorney David Schoen met with him for five hours. Epstein was optimistic and looking forward to a bond hearing. I had mapped out kind of a four prong defense approach that I thought we should take. And he was very excited about it, very upbeat. Sean says Epstein revealed that a few days earlier, his former cellmate, Nicholas Tartaglione, had placed something around his neck as part of a so-called experiment. Or prank or something like that going on. And he put a rope around Mr. Epstein's net throat and then pulled it. That left the abrasion, um, left him quite shaken. So on, he didn't feel he was in a position to refuse it. Tartaglia was a former cop on trial for murdering four people. He used a twist tie to strangle one of them. Schoen says Epstein told him Tartaglio pulled the rope around his neck, making an abrasion. When guards saw the marks the next day and assumed Epstein had tried to hang himself, Schoen says Epstein decided not to correct them. He said that he told the prison officials that he couldn't remember what had happened because he didn't want any trouble. He didn't want to be perceived to be a rat or you know something like that, and he was just hoping the whole incident would go away. The jail moved Tartaglione out of Epstein's cell for an undisclosed reason and did not put in a new cellmate, even though management had ordered he have one. While unsupervised, with guards sleeping and the cell block cameras not working, Epstein died overnight. Epstein's brother Mark Epstein and others maintained he was murdered to keep him quiet about his wide network of politically elevated and wealthy friends. Terry Parker, WPBF 25 News.